to end her time with Chelsea. A glorious trophy-laden decade behind her. The Champions League, the only one missing from her extensive collection. She's making some really clever runs, Matteo. Chelsea just can't keep it at the moment. Paris FC on top, Borja! Good save by Berger, who was well positioned. But Paris FC really are looking to take the game to Chelsea here. They are, and just as you said, Adam, down this, our, this near side here, it's really good play from... I talked about how she feels she's a really intelligent footballer. Yeah, I think this is going to be a really good test for her, though, because at the moment, Paris are trying to play down their right-hand side because they know Lauren James probably wouldn't track back as well. And then you've got Neve Charles who pushes forward. So there are gaps back there, and I could see Neve Charles actually asking Emma Hayes, do you want me to go forward? And she has stayed a little bit behind defensive. Lauren James! Well, after a hat-trick at the weekend, you'd have backed her there, wouldn't you? That was definitely a chance, wasn't it? It just opened up for her. A lovely little pass. Forcier winning the ball back there. Quick in transition. Lovely step over from Sam Kerr, wasn't it? Charles. Just got away from Sam Kerr. Now it's Sissoko to get it clear. And Chelsea will come again here with Lauren James. Nice bit of skill. And a lovely cross too, that's a superb goal! What about that for an assist from Lauren James? Few players in the game would have even saw that that was on. And Sam Kerr, she was right on the end of it, anticipated the cross, and then finished it with some aplomb. 1-0 foot. What a ball, what a run from Sam Kerr. She just holds it and great finish. And impossible to mark, right? Absolutely. Blind side, side in, Gray Barvel. Great finish from Sam Kerr. What a ball that is from Lauren James, the weight of it. James. Cuthbert. No one back though by Tine. Borgia. And do you know when Lauren James got on that ball, I was nearly going to shout at her to pass infield. Fleming's in now. That's a good save. And it was written can read who'd burst through there. Plenty forward here for Paris. Sissoko, the centre half, one of them. Berger thought about coming for it, then went back, and it's in! They couldn't keep it out. Cartier was on the line. Grebeauval was forward. And Paris have levelled it at Stamford Bridge from a set piece all their players back Berger does think about coming for it changes her mind but then is caught neither here nor there she shouldn't be scoring a header from there and yeah they do they link up really well together you could just see right here that care has dropped in and Kirby's filled in that space behind her Tine with the pass this is Matteo and Borgia oh lovely skill can she finish good save Berger such a nice move that by Paris FC, but Borgia denied the goal. What a save. What an important save from Berger. Tine with the shot, which is watch wide by Berger. And a big moment at the start of the second half. Crucial, crucial save from Berger. It's really good play. Good touch in from Borgia. You expect. James. Kirby's found space. It's taken on superbly by Ritten Can reads. And in it goes. Sam Kerr with another. Great cross to pick her out. He's just got that knack of being in the right place at the right time. Lauren James coming into midfield, creating the overload. And Fran Kirby finding those areas. She's offside. She's offside. Doesn't matter. She scored, but what a great ball in from Canary. Orge does. She's a physical number nine and starts the press. She initiates the press for Paris FC, which is really important. Sam Kerr on a hat trick and gets it spectacularly. 
What a player! What a moment! She's amazing! It doesn't matter, let's just talk about this player here. What a finish from her. And she's under pressure. It's not an easy thing to do. 84 for her in the English top flight. 115 of those with Chelsea. What a career she's had. She, again, like Kirby, will sit in those pockets, sit in those areas. And she's extremely good at running at defenders. Kirby. Ingle. Cuthbert, nice turn, good shot! Not far away. She praised her Scottishness, says she's streetwise confident. Tine. Could they get one back, Paris FC? It's Tine again. Julie Schweier. Good movement from Tine. The pullback's good to Fleury. Good chance. Ritting can read. She's been really impressive tonight. That's a good ball too to Kirby. Oh, what a measured pass. Kerr again. That would have been some goal. It deserved it, didn't it? Mielda. Chelsea's next game, a home to Leicester in the WSL at the weekend. They then have a London derby at Arsenal after that, before Hecken come to London. It's Fleury. Still going. Lawrence. Abdelina, it was who slid in at the expense of a corner. Say we'll take it. Chelsea finish with a flourish. Ah, oh, they do finish with a flourish. Lovely finish that by Sophie Ingle. Made it look so easy. Brilliant goal. 4-1 Chelsea. And it's all about the movement there from Sophie Ingle, just coming from around the back. Mielde just turning around, taking her player out. And it's Graveval just losing Sophie Ingle there, but she's still had to finish it. She did very well. Wuldo Sin. Well, Chelsea have their first win of the group stage. Sam Kerr, outstanding, a hat-trick for the Chelsea centre-forward.